All right, so in this video, we're going to be talking about grouping and ungrouping. And as you can see on my little design space app, we have the layers panel on the far right. And if you don't have one on yours, uh, that's probably because you have it toggled off right now. So you can use that little toggle. And then we also have the action menu up. So make sure you have your action menu up in order to group and ungroup. Uh, now, something real quick. Now, these are just images here from the Cricut Image Library. And you can see that when I click on it, um, it's selecting both layers at the same time. So we can see that right here uh, with this squirrel. Although it does have two layers, they are in a group. So that's how we can tell that an item is in a group, is looking at the layers panel itself. And we can see the little toggle down uh, arrow. That also indicates that there is a group. All right. So how do we ungroup things? Well, you, you select the item that is grouped and you can come all the way over here that's on that action menu and click the ungroup button. Now, uh, each one of those items is now a separate item, right? Now we can get it back to be in a group again. We'd have to select both layers and then we're able to go ahead and uh, group it again. So that will put it back into a group, although it did lose its name. If you see, it's uh, back to uh, just group in general. It used to say squirrel. So uh, something else with the groups that you want to keep in mind is that, you know, we do have some tips here. So uh, grouping is only for convenience. It's not, like I said, has nothing to do when you click the go button on how it looks when you cut. Okay. It has absolutely no uh, effect on that. It's just for convenience. You can size things that are groups a lot easier when you're trying to grow and shrink things. Okay. Uh, the other thing is uh, layers still do retain their individual layer properties. That means that this file here, uh, as you can see, this layer is still uh, still a cut layer. You know, uh, it is still the color brown. However, we can change that layer to something else and it has no effect of what everything else that is grouped in it. So it still retains the cut, still retains the color, whether that be cut, write, score, or print. All right. So that's really it with grouping and ungrouping, uh, really for convenience, convenience only for sizing, positioning, that kind of stuff. Um, so hopefully you enjoyed this video and continue on with the action menu lessons. All right.